Welcome back to Uncensored. Pianist Brendan Kavanagh, aka Dr. K, was entertaining crowds at St Pancras Station in London on the public piano there when he was approached by a group of flag-waving Chinese onlookers who demanded he stopped filming. In a shocking twist, the police then seemed to back the tourists. And today, the piano's been mysteriously cordoned off. All very mysterious. Um, it was quite bizarre. Dr. K, you join me now. I watched the whole video to get a proper context for this. You're just minding your own business. Sure. You're playing beautiful piano, as you do. You're a very talented guy. Thank you, Piers. Uh, people are enjoying it, and, they, yeah. and your shtick is they come over and interact right. with you, and it's great. Um, very harmless and fun. Um, and this is you in action. I mean, fantastic. But then this group of Chinese people in the background with their, with their flags yes. come over and sort of believe they have the right <laughs> to stop you filming yes. and doing what you're yeah, doing. Absolutely. Let's have a listen to what happened. OK. This is our right we're protecting, and that's it. But what right? I don't understand. Image right. We are protecting our own image right. You're not sharing. But this, we're in public. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, no. But we're in a free country, mate. That's true. We're you're not in communist country. China now, you know. Oh, I'm sorry. This is reasons now. We have no, we're not in communist China. We're in a free country. We've got a Chinese flag there. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. matter. Show me the Chinese matter. flag. Why are you touching her? I'm Stop not. touching her! Don't touch her, I, please. I Do not touch her. Please. You are not the same age. Please do not touch her. Oh, Don't I, I, touch her. It was totally bizarre. He got very angry, that guy. But I also yeah, thought was. the policewoman who came over to you, yes. I didn't like what she was doing either, which was almost no. acquiescing to this. Well, absolutely. She completely took the side of the Chinese. Because they mentioned the R word, um, racist, mm. uh, she melted like a jelly. And... and nothing you said was racist at all. Well, I, th I think she said her, her beef with me was that I said, we're, I said we're not in China now. Yeah. And she found that an extremely offensive phrase because she said that would hurt the feelings of the Chinese around the piano. Mm. And you can hear her whispering, you can't say that. And I said, what? And she said, you can't say we're not in China now. I said, that's a factual statement. And I think when the police deal with these politically correct issues, they're all over the place because they think they're going to offend someone. Mm. And so she took it out on me. She thought she was, I suppose, virtue signaling, signaling to her masters. And uh, but she did. The irony is, they yeah. were filming themselves, <laughs> some kind of commercial. Sure, and they were also filming me. It's been pointed out if you actually right. watch the video. There's a guy in a gimbal from from the CCP. Uh, 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 mm. group that was there who was constantly filming me. One of the girls was filming me, but they said I wasn't allowed to film them and that I needed to delete my footage because they had uh, a disclaimer that no one was allowed to film them in the station. Okay, quite bizarre. What's, it's really hit a nerve. Over six million people have yeah. now watched this online. Yeah. You probably never had a reaction quite like this, have you? Well, no. And also, I've got to tell you, I've just before I came in, Piers, I've just had a phone call. The video is on the verge of being taken down by YouTube because I've had a second strike against it. So someone does not want this video to be taken... Uh, doesn't want this video to be there. Um, it's about to be taken down, so if anyone's watching this, please download it. And if the video disappears, um, obviously pressure's been put on YouTube. To what does it tell it you about where we are with free speech in the world? Right? Ah, well, this whole thing was a mini parable about the value of free speech. It was a spontaneous live stream. Um, we were attempted to be shut down. Um, but in the end, free speech prevailed. And I think that's why it's got such a lot of traction yeah. around the world, because where do you see free speech prevailing in, in a little mini-drama? Mm. Um, and that's what happened. They walked away, free speech prevailed, but now they want to take the video down. The video is on the verge of being taken down. Please, if you're watching this, download the video. And if the video gets taken down, let's kick up a stink. How did the police end up with you over the whole thing? They called the... They, there was about five of them, and one of, the, one of the group went and got the police and said that we've got here a violent thug who is threatening us and is calling us communists and uh, we feel threatened. And he also needs to delete his footage. And uh, the police lady immediately took their side and uh, she gave me quite a hard time. She told me I couldn't say things. She said to stop mm. filming. No, I watched it. I, was, I couldn't understand what she was doing. Uh, oh, she... <laughs> Well, I knew what she was doing, but I, I couldn't, couldn't understand, understand why. it either, Piers, you know. Yeah. I th what I... reaction have you... I mean, have you been back since to play the piano? Uh, no, my, my friend Terry, I've got a good friend, my friend Terry Miles, uh, God bless him, he was there today. He's a, he's a fantastic mm. uh, YouTuber. He was there today. And there was e even a protest today supporting the piano and me in St Pancras, free mm. the piano. Terry was <laughs> there today. The piano's back, and I think the... the, the... When are you back there? <laughs> 
I don't know if I should say, Pitch. Yes, you should. Do you think I should go back? Advise Absolutely. Me. Give me your... Will you come go with back me? back tomorrow morning. <laughs> you reckon? Yes. You reckon? Of course. You'll be a superstar now. You reckon? You get bigger crowds than Elton John, who I think, <laughs> who I think donated the piano, didn't he? He did. And Elton's team has been contacted by the Daily Express to give a comment on the fact that the piano was shut off. Mm. Um, but when they heard that, they actually released the piano, so it's back in use again. But um, well, When are you going back? Come on. Give me a scoop. Piers, Piers, Piers. I, I don't know if I can. I it's don't... free speech. Spit it out, man. I might go on Friday. Friday? This Friday. What kind of time are people are in town? Piers, Piers, Piers. I want to cause Piers, a commotion. Piers, Piers, you're, you're, you're stirring this up, man. <laughs> you're, you're stirring if this anyone up. Anyone from the Piers. Communist Party in China oh is watching goodness. this. Look. I can't tell you when he's performing, but it's Piers. Friday. Uh, look, <laughs> M MI5 have told me to keep a low profile. I'm only joking. I'm only joking. But look, I, I'm, I may be there on Friday, but. I, you, you know, it's it's a, it's a sensitive situation. Um, the police, British Transport Police, yep. have freaked out. St Pancras have freaked out. But people have... You know what? They should Go all on. just calm down and recognise we live, uh, last time I checked, on, in please. a free democratic country and you are allowed to play the piano where you've played it many Piers. times. We've got to leave it there. Piers. Great God to bless. see you, Brendan. God bless. All the best. Thank you. Get down to St Pancras. We're all behind <laughs> you. That's it from me. Whatever you're up to, keep it uncensored. Woo. Especially from the communists in China. God bless you, Piers.